you guys welcome back to the channel we are in my bedroom because bedroom has the because the bedroom has the coolest background in my opinion other than you know the game room but I didn't feel like going all that way but today is um, today's video is we're gonna be putting a skin and a case and a screen protector on the Steam Deck it's taken probably a little longer than I want it to for the skin to show up. I got one from D Brand. Um, I have not done any research other than seeing a couple of reviews saying they were kind of harder to put on. But we're going to figure it out today. We're going to make it happen because it's kind of hard to find skins for your Steam Deck right now. Um, I did find one on Etsy. And honestly, they sent me a color that I didn't really like. Uh, but the customer service was really good and I feel like, I mean, I would still recommend them just because if you get, a, I mean, you order the skin, it's either a color you like or you don't like. They'll refund you if you don't like it. Like, it's just no real loss there. And it's about $10 cheaper, probably 10 or $20 cheaper than honestly going to D brand. I think I spent $20 on Etsy and 40 for D brand. So you know, do with that what you will. But, um, okay, we're gonna relocate to the kitchen table and start putting the skin on the deck. Um, can you guys guess the color? Can you guess? <laughs> All right. All right, I just realized, I don't even think I fully introduced myself. My name is Chrissy. Most of you guys probably already know that, but if you're kind of new here, just popping in. How you doing? Uh, like subscribe all of that this is the little packaging for D brand so nice it's like are these aliens um they look like aliens I'm not familiar with these characters maybe they're like an original design um the station I am working on is not all that clean let me get a wipe and wipe this down really quick and we'll try this again because workstation is looking pretty bad here. It hasn't showed up yet, but I also bought a skin for my cell phone from D brand just because I was just like, why not? I'm already here. Let's do it. All right. As for we'll put this stuff to the side we're gonna be using my Dyson air wrap to kind of adhere the skin to the actual steam deck because I saw a review that a blow dryer is helpful and honestly that's the blow dryer I have let's go ahead and get this open this is a lot of packaging oh that's so interesting I love this. Okay, so the price is starting to make sense. So, first of all, they put it in just these little mats. I guess these are like little mats you can work off of. I love this. It's a lot of packaging and plastic, but I don't know. So I guess you put the little cover down there where you have a clean workstation. Look how nice, nice. And then this is the front of my Steam Deck. I don't know if you guys know this, but I am obsessed with this color right now. So we got the front and this is the back with um, some sort of cloth there. Seems like a, very, a lot of unnecessary packaging. I think it's because they sell the front and back separately. I don't know why. So you can get the front, I think for 20 bucks and then for an additional like maybe 19 and some change or something, you get the back. I don't know. It seems like, hey, we got a monopoly on the market. Let's take advantage. I don't know. <laughs> seems like a lot to do, but Let's go ahead and get our Steam Deck out. <laughs> I was playing this game called Let's Build a Zoo and I played it for like probably eight hours straight one day and my animals keep dying and I don't understand what the problem is. It stressed me out so bad that I turned it off. I haven't been back to Let's Play uh, Let's Build a Zoo, 
but you know I just hope that one day my animals will thrive and stay alive that's all I want I swear I'm doing the right thing by them apparently not though right now I have like this hard case one here that I got from Amazon if I can get it off without you know breaking it would be great all right what I like about this case is that it comes in three pieces. I wish the OLED switch case was like this. Oh my God, am I gonna break this? Oof. All right, well, I hope that's all okay. That piece is a little bent, but it's secure. It fits really good on there. We're gonna put this to the side whereas we're gonna end up putting it back on anyway. Um. I bought a screen protector. I'm hoping the screen protector comes with like an alcohol wipey thing because I need it. I just wanna give it a good wipe off really quick just to make sure there's no like additional oils or anything. Um, it looks like there may be instructions on the D brand website on how to put them on because it says purchase, delivered, install, dbrand.com slash how. So the next part of the video is going to be a kind of like a voiceover because I want to be able to focus more on what I'm doing here. So that's why you're seeing from this angle. I think I'm gonna work with the back first. Seems like that might be the easiest thing to start with. Maybe the top. And I believe it goes this way across the top. Oh, you guys, very stressed to be putting a skin on here. I feel like I haven't put on a skin in a very long time. I can't even think when the last time was. I think it was maybe an old switch, one of my older switches. And I believe this cloth that they give you is to like kind of wipe or seal things down so you're not getting grease from your own fingers on the device, I'm assuming. Pretty nicely. Oh, oh my God, I love this color. I don't wanna hype it, but geez, that's gorgeous. The D brand skin. This skin is so thick just the material like you can feel like I'm kind of understanding the price tag now because just the quality it's a very thick case or a very thick skin and I feel like it's not something that you would like easily rip all right I think I feel pretty good about this placement odd that the steam I think that actually says valve the valve logo is kind of like sticking through right there but let's keep working so far I have not needed to use my blow dryer but maybe I should just to give me a little bit more extra stretch in some places using my knuckle to get in these corners because it's a little hard to do with nails and I don't really want to scratch up my skin because I realized I was starting to do that right there with my nail. There we go. One side down. 
looks really good. Ooh, got a little creasy there. What's going on, sir? Why you do that? Let's put down this corner and then we'll move on to the sides. All right, hitting the top half up here. Or should I do the bottom? Ugh, it's kind of hard to decide. I'll just put it on its side and just kind of curve it over. There we go. And then we're gonna do the same for this side. This is not as hard as I thought it was gonna be. Everything's lining up really nicely. Ooh, that's beautiful. Can you guys even really see the color? I feel like it's coming off very kind of gray looking. I assure you it is lilac or light purple, lavender purple, whatever you want, uh, pastel purple, whatever you want to call it. I got a couple creases in areas but i'm not mad about it because this was not it was such a big surface that i was very stressed out about it but here we are we're on the front half now and the front half comes with the what are these called the pads the game pads what are these don't quote me um comes with those covers these covers and that's it just the front half why does it come with this? If you want to put it over the screen, I'm not sure why you would want to do that. What is this piece? Like, why would I want to cover this surface? That's weird. Um, I guess let's start with the little corners. And what's nice is that the Steam Deck actually has these like outlines. So you just kind of line it up with the outlined shape it lays a lot easier, I think. All right, let's hope that uh, that's true. Oh, we got a little crease there. Unacceptable, what are you doing? I wonder why it didn't come with these pieces. That's weird. Huh. I guess this part of it doesn't get covered. Why wouldn't it? Like you're paying for the whole front and back, aren't you? All right, I just went to go peek at a video. They also didn't have those pieces, so I guess that's normal. You can see it's like, because it's curved, you got some creasing going on right there. It lays down really smooth on the top, just the corners, we got a little creasing. Let's move on to the other end. Kind of do the same thing. Oh, here we go again. Let me see if I can make this look a little better. All right, not that much better, but yeah, the corners are just gonna be slightly creasy. Ugh. <sighs> All right, let's see if we can get the front piece on and not too stressed yet. I'm just going to Peel off what we need and leave the rest on the sticky just so I'm not getting my hair on it or it's not folding in on itself. Anything weird like that. All right, let's keep going. I literally have the I wear my sunglasses at night song stuck in my head and it's been playing the whole time since I've been putting this skin on. I just wanted you guys to know that. Most likely because I went and saw Nope um, the other day and that was one of the songs in the movie. I immediately left the theater and downloaded it. Let's put the top half on and then I'm also going to switch out the battery for this camera because it is flashing. All right we are back and 
I just realized I thought I was done and was about to put the case on, but I still need to put on the little, uh, the trackpad decals. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Hopefully they should be pretty quick because they're just little squares. So let's go ahead and love that. So easy. Eee! It's so purple and black, my favorite. All right, there we go. We got that one on now. Look how beautiful, you guys. Look at you in the camera. Don't you see you? That's, that's you. That's gorgeous. All right. All right, so I guess now we're gonna go ahead and put the case on and then the screen protector. And this is just some screen, the glass screen protectors that I got from Amazon. I will go ahead and link the case and the screen protector from Amazon. And I will go ahead and also link dbrand in the description. The Amazon link is an affiliate link, but the dbrand one is not. Also, I thought these wipes were alcohol. This is definitely not alcohol. It stinks, whatever it is. I don't appreciate it. What's up with that? All right, there we go. And then we use the little dust piece to get any stickies off of here. No stickies allowed. All right, I feel good about everything that I got off of there, I think. Whatever's still on there, I guess, just lives there now, and I'll just have to live my life with that. Um, this is the back. So I guess we just place it on and tap it and go about our day. I wear my sunglasses at night. That is not even, but there we go. Please, no air bubbles, please no air bubbles. Yes, no air bubbles, here we go. And then we're gonna use maybe the wet cloth again just to make sure it's sitting down really good. Press down those corners, hit it with the dry again. And now we can put the hard case back on. And I like the hard case because I feel like it's gonna seal in any imperfections I had. Okay, there we go. So you should probably go from the top and then push the bottom in because it just works a little better that way. The case, when I snapped it on, lifted up my skin a little bit, but it's okay. I'm not gonna let that um, upset me, or am I? Hmm. Choices. Then we're gonna do the other. All right, and here we go. We have our lilac, lavender, pastel purple steam deck with a screen protector and hard case. Very nice, I'm feeling very girly, very just on brand for myself right now because this is my color. I still don't know what this extra piece is for. I don't know, but I'm pretty happy. I don't think the screen I don't think the uh, the skin was all that hard to put on. I will say that this hard case is like exact fit, and so adding the um, the skin did make the case a little tight to fit on in like the some areas, like you know the two top pieces. They were a little tight to press on just because of the skin adding that little extra bit of space. I don't know, maybe I need to look into a different kind of hard case, but in the meantime, this one works just fine and it feels the way that I like. I love that hard plastic feel. Um, but yeah, if you made it this far in the video, leave a, do we have any cute like light purple emotes? Not really, but I did notice there was a cute little bubble emoji. So if you made it this far in the video, leave a bubble emoji. Um, 
if you want. Honestly, since we're here, I can show you the games that I currently have on my Steam Deck. I haven't really downloaded anything too crazy. Um, just, all right, let's turn down the ring light. See if that does anything. All right, we have Let's Build a Zoo. And we also have Frambo, Little Witch in the Woods, and um, Among Us, which has which has been on uh, my Steam account for the longest, but keep checking my wish list to see if any of those games that I've been eyeing has released yet. So far, none, but I'm relocating to the couch and I'm going to pay my Steam Deck and lay around for a little bit. I'll see you guys in the next one and bye.